Hello friends. In this lecture, we will solve few numericals based on limits, fits, and the tolerances. So let's begin. The first numerical. In a limit system, following limits are specified for a hole and the shaft assembly. The hole size is given. It is 30 plus 0 0.00 plus 0 0.02. And for shaft, it is 30 minus 0 0.05 minus 0 0.02 mm. Here we have to find out the tolerance and the allowance. So the first we will find out the tolerance. So tolerance for hole. How to find out tolerance? Upper limit minus lower limit or sometimes it is called as HLH higher limit of hole minus lower limit of hole is equal to what is the upper limit 30.02 minus the lower limit 30.00 so the tolerance is 0.02 mm then the tolerance for shaft again the upper limit minus lower limit so for shaft the upper limit is 30 point or we can say the 30 minus 0 0.02 that is the upper limit minus what is the lower limit 30 minus 0 0.05 so 30 minus 0 0.02 29.98 0 minus 29.950 so 0 0.030 mm. So the tolerance for shaft, tolerance for hole. Now the B that is the allowance. What is the allowance? It is the maximum metal condition of hole MMC. Maximum hole minus MMC for shaft. So it is 30.02 minus 29.98. So it is 0 0.04 mm. So that is the allowance for given assembly. The second problem the following limits are specified in a limit system to give a clearance fit between a hole and shaft. Hole size is given 25. With tolerance is 0.03 and minus 0.00 mm. And shaft basic size 25 mm. The tolerances are minus 0.006 and minus 0.020. Determine the following the basic size, the tolerances on shaft and hole, maximum and the minimum clearance. Now first we will find out the basic size. So in this case the basic size is same for hole and shaft and it is 25 mm. 25 mm. Okay. So right here basic size is same for hole and equal to 25 now second we have to find the tolerances on shaft and hole so first we will find tolerance for hole so it is equal to upper limit of hole minus lower limit of hole. So here continue here is equal to what is the upper limit of hole 25 plus 0 0.03 minus what is the lower limit 25 minus 0 0.00. So 
So here it is 25 plus 0 0.03 so 25.03 minus 25 is equal to 0 0.03 mm. So that is the tolerance for the force. Now we will find out tolerance for shaft. Again, the upper limit of shaft minus lower limit of shaft is equal to upper limit is 25 minus 0 0.0. 006 minus 25 minus 0 0.020 is equal to 24.994 minus 24.980. So the answer is 0 0.014 mm. That is the answer. Tolerance on the shaft. Now we have to find out the maximum and the minimum clearances. C. The maximum clearance. Let us have a basic size. We we'll draw a diagram. Okay. So this basic size have the dimension of 25.00. Now we have one hole. This one is the hole. And this dimension we have 25.030 correct yes 25.030 now we have the shaft so we'll draw the shaft over here This one is the shaft. Now for shaft, we have the upper limit and the lower limit. The upper limit is 24.994. Lower limit is 24.980. Now the maximum clearance. So when we will have a hole of dimension 25.030 means when there will be a hole at upper limit and shaft at lower limit. Okay. So the condition is that maximum limit of hole is also called as upper limit of hole minus minimum limit or lower limit of shaft. So here we will get maximum clearance is 25.030 minus 24.980 is equal to so if you do the calculation here you got answer 0 0.050 mm. Okay. In micron you can write maximum clearance is equal to 50 micron. 
now the minimum clearance minimum clearance is equal to the lower limit lower limit of hole minus upper limit of shaft so lower limit of hole is here the basic size that is 25.000 minus an upper limit of shaft means this one that is 24.994 is equal to 0.006 mm or we can write minimum clearance is equal to 6 micro so that is the answer now you can see in both the cases we got some positive value means the given fit is a clearance fit and they have mentioned in the uh, statement that to give a clearance fit so they have mentioned already means our answer of clearance should be positive only okay so we we'll stop here thank you in this lecture we will solve one numerical based on limit fit and the tolerance so we we'll read the statement first tolerance is for a hole and shaft assembly having a nominal size of 50 mm are as follows for the hole 50 plus 0.00 and plus 0.020 for shaft 50 minus 0.08 and minus 0.05 mm so that are the tolerances for hole and the shaft now we have to determine the maximum and the minimum clearances the tolerances on shaft and hole the allowance the mml that is maximum material limit for hole and the shaft and the type of fit so one by one we'll solve all this initially we'll draw one diagram first so we can draw the diagram by two ways we can draw the hole and inside hole we can show one shaft the first method the second method we can draw basic size and then we can draw the hole and shaft so we'll go by the second one so we'll draw the basic size this one is the basic size basic size or the nominal size both are same the basic size is 50.000 then we have the hole lower limit is 0.00 so lower deviation so we can say that it is a whole basis system because one deviation is zero that is the fundamental deviation so here we can draw one diagram and we can name it as a whole so this one is the 50 and this one is the 50.02 now we we'll draw the shaft for the shaft we have only the negative dimension the first is 50 minus 0.08 so here shaft so the upper limit for the shaft is 50 minus 0.08 so this one is 49.950 point 49.9 2.0. So we will solve the first one maximum and minimum clearances. So when we will get the maximum clearance? When there will be the upper limit for the hole? Upper limit means this 50.02 minus the lower limit of shaft is equal to. So it is 50.02 minus 49.02. 920 so the total clearance is 0.10 mm in micron we can write 100 micron that is the maximum clearance now we'll solve for the minimum minimum clearance is equal to the lower limit of hole 
minus the upper limit of shaft. What is the lower limit of hole? It is 50 0.000 minus is 49.950 49.950 and here we will get the answer 0.05 mm or we can write it in a micron like 50 micron so the both the clearances are the positive so we can answer here the question e types of fit types of fit it is a clearance fit it is a clearance fit now we will solve for the b b c d now the b in b we have to find out the tolerances tolerance on hole and the shaft so first we will find the tolerance on hole so we have the basic size 50 plus 0 0.02 and then 50 minus 0 0.00 so here we will get 50.02 minus 50.00. So the total tolerance on hole is 0.02 mm. Similarly the tolerance on shaft. It is 50 minus 0.05 minus 50 minus 0.08. So here 50 minus 0.05 means 49.0. 950 minus 49.920. So the total tolerance on shaft is 0 0.03 mm. That is the answer for B. Now C, what is the C? We have to find out the allowance. Now how to find out the allowance? So for allowance, we have to consider the maximum material condition of the shaft and the maximum material condition of the hole. So what is the maximum material condition of shaft here? Maximum metal condition of hole minus maximum metal condition of shaft is equal to it is 50 that is the maximum minus here 49.950. So here we will get a allowance of 0 0.05. Now D. In D, we have to find out the maximum material limit of hole mm. MML maximum material limit of hole means when the hole will have the maximum material. That is the lower limit. So lower limit of hole. So at lower limit, the hole will have the maximum material. So it is 50 mm. And mml of shaft. Mml means the position or the dimension when the hole or the shaft will have the maximum material. So here it will be the upper limit. Upper limit or sometimes we can say the higher limit. Higher limit on the shaft. So what is the higher limit for the shaft? It is 49.950 mm. So these are the answers. And for E, we already mentioned since both the maximum and the material for the E, we have already said that the maximum and the minimum, both clearances are positive, maximum and minimum clearances are positive. Hence, the given fit is a clearance fit. That's it. So, we'll stop here. Thank you.